Mr. Geeson, the governor wants his cigarette tax. What's the future? Well, John, let me say that the governor has decided that there are a number of priorities that were not met in the budget bill, although the budget committee and the appropriations committee, as he has stated, did an excellent job with it. He's now said to finance these, he would like to see the cigarette tax passed. I would say that at this point, there's uh, at least an even chance that this cigarette tax might be enacted by this General Assembly. Do you see, possibly see a compromise that the governor may come out for Senator Stone's gas tax if uh, he could get support for his tobacco tax? Well, certainly in uh, the realm of legislation, compromise is the name of the game. And I'm sure that the governor is, is reviewing all possibilities uh, as to how he can accomplish what he thinks is best for the Commonwealth. You had an opportunity last night, along with other Republicans, to meet with the governor. Did you all discuss this question? Uh, we certainly discussed the cigarette tax and uh, how uh, it, the funds might be used and how the, um, the tax might be enacted. What strategy are you going to use now? Well, we we're going to check with members to see how they stand, and the governor is going to, again, review what needs to be done and see what compromises he might be able to work out.